Hey folks, good afternoon, 1224. Finally, we're seeing some rain over in Cameron County. So if you're headed over to Harlingen, check this out, folks. Uh, along the interstate, we are seeing some of that rain and a few thunderstorms develop. And we could expect more rain and thunderstorms throughout the rest of the afternoon, as we currently still have a 50% rain chance throughout the valley. Now, not everybody will be receiving rain, so that's important to remember. But there is a good chance that uh, a lot of people will. And we are still currently seeing mostly cloudy skies across the valley. Very limited sunshine at the moment. Across Texas, we're seeing a lot of activity as well over to the eastern part of our uh, over in the big bend of Texas. And all of that is due to that frontal system that did move across our area, which also did give us cooler conditions for our valley. We are expecting highs to be reaching around 94 degrees for today. So previously, the last couple of days, we were pretty fried here with those triple digit temperatures across our area. This is what our RPM model will be showing us throughout the next couple of hours. Like I mentioned, uh, some activity could still be, be developing er early during the afternoon, and so it will remain mostly cloudy across our valley and rain chances will not only be present for today, but they could be showing up for tomorrow up to a 40% then a 50% as well on Wednesday. So best chance is early in the afternoon for all three days. Now by Wednesday, that rain chance is due to another frontal system that we are expecting to continue to push across Texas. Current conditions, temperatures reaching 93 degrees in Brownsville, 94 in McAllen, and 84 in Harlingen. Currently, winds coming in from the north, 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 northeast, all that courtesy to that frontal system at about 10 miles per hour. So finally, we are seeing a little bit more drier conditions than the usual. The humidity is a little lower uh, today as well, so mostly cloudy for today. Rain chances up to 50% highs at 94 with winds coming in from the northeast from 10 to 15 miles per hour. Across Texas, we're still uh, seeing conditions a bit cooler to the north, 67 degrees in Amarillo, 71 uh, a little more south in Abilene, 80 in the San Antonio area and us still a bit warm at 94 degrees, but we are pretty thankful that it's a lot lower than what we saw um, the, these last couple of days. So for tonight, if you have plans for this evening, lows will be around 75 degrees, mostly cloudy. Rain chances could be at around a 40% for tonight. Our RPM, RPM model is still showing some activity possibly for this evening. For the next three days, folks, take a look at this. Temperatures will be ranging in the 90s, 94 for today, and the lower 90s for Tuesday and Wednesday. Our last record highs were triple digits for all three days, and our average temperature during this time of year is usually 94 degrees. Now, uh, like I mentioned, those winds are pretty light at the moment. Some of the winds coming in from the west, some from the east, and some from the north, so we're, we have a variable of winds at the moment. Our coastal forecast showing us that uh, there is no advisory, but we do have some scattered showers and thunderstorms that could develop throughout the day. Uh, high temperatures in the, the coastal area at around 88 degrees. We have a low rip current risk and our next high tide will be occurring at 9 49 p.m. So our seven day forecast provided to you by AccuWeather is uh, 94 for today. We dropped to 92 by Tuesday and Wednesday. Still that activity showing up for these three days and we could possibly still see some a.m. showers for Thursday by Friday, partly cloudy, 94 degrees. And then by Father's Day, still pretty warm at 97. That was a look at your first one five weather forecast. We'll be right back.